welcome back to my channel for those that are new to my channel i'm jenny for 20 and welcome guys today i have a special guest here guys a lot of you guys don't know my son andrew he's gonna be recording a video with me you want to say hi andrew hi <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna be recording a video today and guys don't mind him he's a little shy because he doesn't really come out in camera or like you know like a sit down video with me so today we're gonna be recording a video i asked you guys to ask us questions for both of us on instagram and i have i i saved the good ones so we're gonna start off by asking questions and then we'll do like story times for some of them okay so are you ready andrew yeah okay so first question um how do you feel about your parents smoking weed i don't i don't, I don't have a problem with it but like if it was like how do you explain this like if, be honest like we want honesty. Alright, I don't. I don't mind it at all. But if it was like, like a lot, and I like walk in and walk. Hold on. If I walked in and they like are smoking, then that would be a problem. But they just do it like for like videos, right? Like you don't. Yeah, for videos. Do <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I, I guess what I mean, what you're really trying to say is that you don't mind us smoking, but if we were doing it like disrespectfully and smoking in yeah. front of you guys, then yeah. you would have a problem with yeah. it. Okay, yeah, it makes sense because when we do smoke, we try to avoid it from even being around the kids, I guess, in the videos. I'm just <laughs> um, we try to avoid it from doing it around the kids, so um, I guess that's what he means by that. How do you feel about your mom being a YouTuber? Um, <clears throat> it, this one is kind of like awkward because, like, I get the, the sometimes, like, here and there, I get the camera pointed like in my face, uh -huh. so it's just like sometimes it's just, um, like. At, at certain points where I'm like, I'm like, uh oh, like I see you recording, I just try to get away from it because, like, I'm just like not really used to the camera. Uh -huh. But for you, it's good because, like, you know, you're doing something that I, I think you enjoy. I enjoy. Yeah, it's good. Have you ever beat his ass? <laughs> <laughs> I have, I have. I, I don't do it as much no more, um, but when he was smaller, I did used to beat his ass. Do you remember one time that I beat your ass really bad? Yeah. When? Tell us a story. Um, so. We were like in the mall and I was acting up then well it wasn't really you, it was my dad. Mm. But you were there too and So your dad gave you a good one? <laughs> what did your dad <laughs> take me to the rest they every time I would act up they would take me to the restroom and then I'll come out quiet after that. <laughs> 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 I think everybody knew that but he he did he used to move his ass in the restroom every time he will act up like in the mall. So he, he wasn't really like a bad kid because we were kinda like on him. Like every time that he will act up, he will get a good one in the restroom. And your tias and everybody would notice that you would just come out like so quiet. Like. Oh, yeah, I don't <laughs> What's the best advice your mom has given you? It's a lot. The best one that you'd be like, okay, this is this is a good one. Hmm. I don't know. I forgot how it goes, but she one time she told me to you know enjoy life and not rush into things because then like <clears throat> later on in life you're gonna regret not doing not doing it. Like yeah. how do you explain it? Like don't grow up too fast. That's, she, that's enjoy yeah. enjoy every moment. I went through it actually so I tried to give him that advice so not to try to grow up and enjoy his age you know his time there's time for everything because I feel like when I was young and um, I was his age I was kind of like wanting to be already 18 and like you know trying to be trying to grow up too fast and obviously somewhat around his age um, well not really around his age because he's gonna be 14 but closer to his age I you know I got pregnant and I, gr I had to grow up so fast like literally it was changing diapers crying and you know it's just like your life completely changes and and i felt like if i if i was his age i would like to enjoy life you know kind of get wait there's time for everything you know you don't have to rush things so that's really what i tell him because i went through it and i want him to enjoy life like i don't want him to try to grow fast because once once you become like i wish for this age and now that i'm at that age i feel like i wish i was younger because you have a lot of responsibilities come especially if you have kids like you're not only thinking about yourself no more you have to think about your family yeah how do you feel about him getting a girlfriend <laughs> honestly he or it's not how do i feel about him getting a girlfriend and at this point it's about him having a girlfriend i really don't mind him having a girlfriend 
like i i don't mind like i told i told i specifically told him that you know whenever he had a girlfriend like i want him to be open to me i um i want to know you know because i there is advice that i like since i grew i had a baby at a young age and i had a boy well, i had a boyfriend and then a baby at a young age um i try to grow up so fast so i try to give him advice you know and on, on how to be good and just enjoy the moment because just start thinking about getting married and all that stuff so i tell him like to take things slowly and take things at his time but i don't mind him having a girlfriend and i just want him to be open to me and tell me about his stuff <laughs> i really do because i just want to be here for him like i'm we're growing up together it's just crazy to see that my son's literally sitting next to me what do you mean yeah it's weird to see that i have a kid that's this old already like i, <laughs> I feel like you're my brother or my cousin instead of my son <laughs> I just want him to focus in school and not too much on his girlfriend when it comes down to being in sc at school like i just want him to focus in school and just do his chores and everything that he has to do and i really don't mind him having a girlfriend yeah do you feel your relationship would be different if she had you as a teen oh i i, I get this one so she's basically saying like if you weren't a teen and like, you're like older in life and you had me yeah I definitely would be different my mom's kind of like not my best friend, but he's like my friend, that, like a close friend that I can like go get in touch with because at a young age she's already experienced everything. And if she was older, I feel like um, I would like be more like kind of like distant from her rather than me being close to her because she's young and I'm we're both young. So, so yeah, it makes sense. Who do you admire more, your mom or your dad? Okay, so for this one is it's like two sides one is my dad is like I, I i look at my dad and he's very smart like every advice he gives me i really pay attention because I, I i i um he's just very smart so i i look up to him more but my mom i'm kind of cool with oh so there you go guys he thinks this is that Jaden's more attached to me and i guess he's more attached to his dad but i do feel like brian d does have that thing of like he when he talks to you he kind of talks to you straight up and in a sense like he's he knows what he's saying and some things, some things he's really not good about. When it comes down to that, I guess, cause like he's young too, and you know, his son is a boy, so he gets that kind of communication more than a mom does. Question for you, what's one of your your favorite moments with Andrew? I think my favorite moments with Andrew are really um, now that he's getting older, like when we, we have communication, like we kind of have a bond together and like, um, like be able to talk like calmly, cause, <sighs> I don't know if it's all teens guys like I'm being dead ass like I don't know if it's all teens or what but Andrew has a little attitude no I don't yeah he does I don't know if it's maybe his sign I think I, I for some reason I, I believe in science in, in that aspect that all Aquarius or no what are you uh you don't even know how oh, you yeah, believe it's in not science no, it's not Taurus it's um what are you this is Aquarius huh Sagittarius. Oh yeah, he's like a he's a Sagittarius, I think, and Jessica's a Sagittarius too. They're kind of like anti-social and like so dry sometimes. I don't know why he's like that. He could be like that. But um, my favorite moments with him are when he's like in a better mood and like we get to have like a bond with each other. Yeah. Those are my favorite moments when he listens to me and he's in a good mood. <sighs> Question for Andrew: Which of your mom's tattoos is your favorite? My name right there. Wait, what is that? <laughs> His name. Which one's your favorite? Really? Your favorite tattoo? I like uh, this one right here too. The Bentley one. Uh, That's one of my favorites. Yeah. I want to get more tattoos. I want to get this side. And... You're going to finish this side first and then the go yeah, down? Yeah, I'm going to finish right here uh, next. But What's the coolest thing about your mom? Yeah. My mom's very cool, but I just don't know what. Like, well, what's specific. A, well, one thing. Um... Um, my mom's like a like a very strong woman. Like she can like, I I just like admire my mom because she's like very strong. She's been through so much, and she still puts our needs first and then hers next, which I I, I admire a lot. So I, I think like her being a strong woman is like the coolest thing. No, <laughs> does he know Spanish? Me hablo muy Spanish. <laughs> Yo no hablo español. Is that how you say it? Uh -huh. Yeah, I don't, I don't speak Spanish. I, I'm, I'm a no-sabo kid. I, I don't know. <laughs>
<laughs> he's a no sabo kid. Yeah, he doesn't speak Spanish, guys. I know. I know a lot of like it's it's hard to see him. Like my mom does know a little bit of English. She kind of um, understands what he what the kids say um, because everybody around my mom's house we all talk English, you know. So my mom knows somewhat English, but it's hard when he's trying to talk to Brian's parents because um, they speak Spanish only and like. Um, it's it's hard. It's sometimes she tries to tell him something in Spanish, or she try or she tries to say something in English, and like you know, they should try to understand each other. Andrew doesn't talk Spanish, but he should. I know he should, because it's good to have both languages. Yeah. But we it's it's hard because yeah, I talk English the whole time. Like if I was to talk um a lot of Spanish, I would love I would have loved to teach him how to speak Spanish properly. But I don't talk Spanish unless I'm talking to somebody that uh, that speaks Spanish. At home, we always talk English, so it's kind of hard. Are you in high school already? No, I'm in eighth grade. He's in eighth grade. Um, he'll go to high school next year, which <clears throat> it's crazy how time's flying. How does he feel about you being a YouTuber? Would he like to be one? To would he like to be one or in is one? Um, it's cool that mom's a YouTuber, but I don't want to be a YouTuber. I, um, right now I'm really focusing on uh, boxing because I really love that sport. So that's what I'm focused on right now. Yeah, maybe you could do boxing videos no. when you're in the ring. No. <laughs> but we try to push them to you know to follow something that they like so he's boxing and um yeah we're just you know we're letting time go and see where this is gonna take him if that's something that he likes i admire him a lot because he likes to it seems like he likes to take care of his body like he likes to work out and he likes to box so that's good for him he's barely 13 i can i can't wait to see what how he's gonna look when he gets older because he that's something that he enjoys doing and i'm proud of him does he talk back? How do you handle it with an ass whooping? No, just he don't. <laughs> he does talk back. I talk back here and there when it's only when, like, I don't like something. Like, if she would tell me something and I just kind of like a little bit talk back, but she takes it like kind of the wrong way sometimes. But yeah, sometimes I do talk back, but it's a bad habit. Yes, it is a bad habit. He does talk back. What's your favorite thing together? Hmm. When we just lay down and watch movies sometimes. Well, not with like together, but it's always like me, my mom, my dad, and my brother. We just like lay down and watch movies. That's that's pretty much what we do. I like going to the movies with you guys. Yeah, too. the movie theaters we we did like on a Saturday or Sunday. Yeah, confess confess is something Jenny doesn't know yet, but will now. <laughs> I can't do that. Um. So confess is something Andrew I don't know about. I don't know. I have really, I'm I'm a good kid. <laughs> Milo. That one, I don't like that one. I don't like that question. Whoever it is, I don't <laughs> like you. <laughs> how do you feel about having a cool mom and how did you find out you smoke weed? Oh, uh, uh, I remember this one. Okay, so mom, I, I like my mom because she's very cool. My friends, my I don't know why my friends think my mom's so cool, but I don't think she's that cool. But she, <laughs> I'm kidding. But yeah, um, uh, my mom, so one time... My mom was about to record a video of, um, or you're about to upload a video of you smoking. So I was in my room and you you're, you had a talk. I was sitting down playing my game. You came in my room telling me that you smoked. I kind of already knew before, but <laughs> yeah, you you kind of confessed to me, and then I was like, I, I was open about it because you know it's my mom. She's gonna hit me. <laughs> but yeah, it, I, um, yeah, that's how she told me. I had to be honest with him. I guess even though he knew, but it's still I feel like as a mom, I still had to give my part. For him to, you know, to understand that this is what I do. I told him the truth, you know, I'm like, oh, before you hear it out there, whatever, you see a video, because obviously when you're on YouTube, you, it, you um, my video could come across his video or, or, or you know, Jaden's video or whoever's video, and then they're gonna be like, what the heck, my mom smokes, you know? Has anyone mentioned your mom being an, a cool influencer at school? Yeah, my friends. Also... Yeah, just my friends, and sometimes like like people I don't really talk to, but they they definitely like. They tell you. Yeah. Your tia asked. Your tia Stephanie asked, "Who's your favorite tia?" <laughs> Lupe. <laughs> <laughs> Who's your favorite tia? Um, Lupe is very nice, but I feel like my tia was a schooler. <laughs> but yeah, but Lupe is very nice. And Lupe's more like sweet, so I guess he does like both of them, but Lupe's more on like on the sweet, nice side. That's how he sees her. And what about Jessica? Jessica, we have beef, Jessica. <laughs> what do you like about your mom? Um, not a lot of things. 
that you do my chores. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> you know, you're, you're just very, she's very open to me. Like, I would tell her something and she would be open and give me a good response. How old were you and Brian when you found out, yeah, um, you found out Andrew was on his way? Well, how I found out was I was late and um, I told Brian that we were having a baby. That's crazy. I told Brian we were having a baby and then I remember I was too scared to tell my mom about it so my mom used to have a, a, a good friend of hers um that was around at that time like a lot so um i told her that i was pregnant and then she told my mom and then my mom found that i was pregnant so um i think brian told his parents on his own that i was pregnant and then his parents wanted to meet my mom because i don't think they had met each other like me and brian were literally dating for a year and my mom knew who brian was and his mom knew who i was um, because of, sometimes I would go to her, uh, Brian's house, but um, they, my mom and him's mom never met each other. They kind of got in an argument um, at first when they, found, yeah, when they found out I was pregnant. I had Andrew when I was 15, and me and Brian got, yeah, like I, well, I got pregnant when I was 15. I had, I, I met Brian when I was around 14, and we were together for a whole year, and we felt like, you know, we were at that, we, we had that kind of love, like, you know, they're gonna be the only ones, and that's the only person that you wanna be with, right? So, um, we were trying to rush things, we were like, oh, we're talking about marriage, and you know, we were fucking 15, obviously, but like, we didn't have nobody to talk to us, like, we really didn't have anybody to talk to us. My mom wasn't really good at communication, because she didn't get that as when, when she was young. So I guess like I can't blame her for that and I guess Brian's mom was the same way like um he to what he tells me that um his 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 mom wouldn't really talk to him either when or his parents you know they were too busy working and they didn't really really talk to him so he was kind of like on his own in, in that sense so we kind of like you know we both kind of had that 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 um that connection in a way and we were we will just fucking want to grow up already we're like talking about kids and all this like oh we're gonna have kids um soon and this and that so it's not like we didn't plan andrew andrew was planned it was planned but in our minds we didn't even think about anything else but that baby like it's just crazy how you really don't think about anything but the moment my point here is i would say just enjoy life guys when we had andrew at a young age we struggled a lot because we didn't fucking have a job we had to depend on other people so i hope you guys enjoy this video and make sure you guys like comment share and subscribe and turn on your post notifications and i'll see you on my next video peace